In this video, you will learn how super empaths destroy narcissists' ego. Narcissists are egotistical and self-centered individuals. Narcissists' self-confidence is superficial as they only use it to cover up the insecurities and emptiness. Super empaths are the type of empaths who are courageous enough to deflate the narcissists' inflated egos. Super empaths do not intend to maliciously drag down narcissists. They only want to bring narcissists' feet back on the ground. Super empaths perfectly understand that the higher the narcissists fly, the greater the narcissists will fall. Watch until the end as I break down to you 10 ways how super empaths destroy narcissists' ego. Are you ready? Let us begin. Number 1. Super empaths silence the super loud and proud narcissists. Narcissists can be best described by these two words, loud and proud. Narcissists wish the public to know their good deeds as if they are broadcasting it through a megaphone. They always want to talk about themselves and brag about their achievements. It is noisy and annoying, right? You have to wait for a long time listening to narcissists' enumeration of their accomplishments and milestones in life. Narcissists' ultimate goal is to be in the spotlight, snatching the eyes and ears of other people to be directed towards them. So. Narcissists do their best and take so much time given a chance to introduce themselves to others. Being polite, patient, and respectful, you just have to listen to the loud and proud narcissists. However, super empaths cannot tolerate this kind of noise and attitude, especially if narcissists come to a point where they degrade or insult other people. If that happens, super empaths destroy narcissists' egos by interrupting them in the middle of their speeches and opening their eyes to the moment of truth, leaving narcissists speechless and defenseless. Number 2. Super Empaths Take Off Narcissists' Fancy Masks Narcissists created a false self, perfect, flawless, blameless, and unrivaled. Their sense of grandiose is supported by wearing their fancy masks. Some people are fooled by their filtered charm and charisma, but not the Super Empaths. Super empaths can uncover narcissists' true faces behind their fancy masks. How? Super empaths are known as expert mind and body language readers and interpreters. Super empaths can detect narcissists' fears, insecurities, and desires. Super empaths destroy narcissists' inflated egos by exposing their true dark colors. This action will warn other people about how dangerous it may be when dealing with fake people like narcissists. Super empaths do not expose narcissists out of hatred or revenge, but prevent others from being victimized by narcissistic abuse. Number 3. Super empaths do not obey narcissists' command. Narcissists have a delusional sense of superiority where they think of themselves as persons in authority, VIPs, or kings and queens. Narcissists are bossy and demand other people as their constituents or below them. Narcissists try to portray a dominant presence so others will be intimidated and forced to obey their commands. However, super empaths would rebel against narcissists' made-up sovereignty and destroy their inflated egos by not obeying narcissists' commands. Narcissists will squirm in anger and go on the verge of their tantrums upon learning that one of their constituents refuses to pay their respect, allegiance, and obedience to them. Super empaths do not tolerate this kind of unjustifiable grandiosity. Super empaths value justice and uphold equality in society. Super empaths are a slave to none and a master of none. They are not hungry for power like narcissists do. Number 4. Super empaths refuse to respond to narcissists' attention-seeking behaviors. Narcissists are attention seekers. They trigger other people's emotions just to be noticed. Their attention-seeking behaviors include impressing other people, making a scandalous scene, and doing life-threatening tricks. This is how desperate narcissists are to get the attention of other people. Many possible factors trigger narcissists' attention-seeking behaviors. One significant factor is their childhood upbringing. Narcissists might not have received enough care and support from their parents, so they seek these things from other people. Super empaths treat narcissists like children and respond to them like how some parents react to their kids in their tantrums. The question is how? Simple, ignoring them until they get tired and decide to give up independently. 
Super empaths who are knowledgeable about how the minds of the narcissists work refuse to respond to their attention-seeking behaviors by giving them their poker faces instead of emotional reactions, which narcissists long for. Number 5. Super empaths refuse to be influenced by narcissists' manipulative tactics. Narcissists are great pretenders and expert manipulators. They try to shift other people's minds to influence their way of thinking. Narcissists' manipulative tactics include gaslighting, victim blaming, brainwashing, and hypnotism. Some people fall into narcissist schemes, but not the super empaths. Known for their mental strength, accurate intuition, and wise judgment, super empaths can block all manipulative techniques deployed by the narcissists. This would badly hurt the inflated egos of the narcissists upon realizing that there are types of empaths who refuse to be influenced by their manipulation. Narcissists want to be influential because they want to have a significant impact on the mental states of others, snatching away their peace of mind. And if people are affected mentally, it would also affect their physical well-being. This is how toxic narcissists are. That is why super empaths refuse to be influenced by their ploys. Number 6. Super empaths refuse to join narcissists' fan club. Narcissists receive either fake or genuine and undeserved flatteries from other people. Narcissists are greedy for everyone's praises and compliments because they fuel their inflated egos. Due to their fancy masks, flowery words, and filtered charm or charisma, some people are fooled by them. However, super empaths are not one of them as they refuse to join narcissists' fan club because they do not want to feed narcissists delusions and fantasies. Super empaths destroy the inflated ego of the narcissists by not joining the clapping crowd and distancing themselves away from these fake people, far away from toxicity. Number 7. Super empaths refuse to take the blame for narcissists' faults. Narcissists are immature individuals as they do not take full responsibility for the consequences of their actions. The only time they are willing to admit their actions is if it would bring them praises, fortune, or benefits. However, when narcissists mess up, they blame other people to escape the penalties of their mistakes. However, super empaths are not martyrs or fools to accept the blame for the faults of others. Super empaths value justice and they will never tolerate any unjust acts. They will pursue narcissists not because they want them, but they will make them pay the price for their offenses. Super empaths fighting spirit will destroy the inflated egos of the narcissists. Number 8. Super empaths cut all narcissistic supplies. Super empaths are wise enough not to allow themselves to become the source of narcissistic supplies. They destroy narcissists' inflated egos by not giving them what they want and need the most. Narcissists are likened to spoiled children due to their immaturity. Tantrums will indeed happen when they are not given their favorite toy or food. Narcissists can never get a hint of narcissistic supply from super empaths. This will leave narcissists disappointed and frustrated. Number 9. Super Empaths Set Up Boundaries Narcissists are known for being trespassers of the private lives of others. They break in and steal whatever narcissistic supply there is in a person. They consume their victims until they are left with nothing. Super Empaths are not the type of empaths who can be easily manipulated. They are excellent at setting up boundaries to prevent others, especially narcissists, from invading their lives and ruining their peace of mind and overall well-being. With such a heavy security system, it would be hard for narcissists to enter super empaths realm. Super empaths destroy narcissists' inflated egos by not welcoming them into their private lives. Like other ordinary people, narcissists thirst for belongingness or become a part of a person's life. Number 10. Super empaths refuse to pursue narcissists. Narcissists want other people to pursue them, as if they are such a huge prize to win in a race. They would love bomb a person to gain their sympathy, trust, and affection, then leave them hanging afterward, creating confusion in that person's mind as to what they have done wrong for them to be left behind. As a result, the victim develops an urge to pursue the narcissists to earn their validation or explanation. However, super empaths will not fall for narcissists' love bombing strategies. And even if narcissists would leave or ghost them, super empaths will never pursue narcissists. This would badly damage narcissists' inflated egos. 
Super empaths have a myriad of ways to destroy narcissist egos, other than those previously mentioned. Are you a super empath? Have you ever extinguished a narcissist's ego? If yes, then keep up the excellent work. I know that super empaths know their limits and they have pure intentions in doing these things against a narcissist. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and subscribe to this channel for more fantastic content. Grab your popcorns and binge watch the following videos right here.